you really don't want me to f with her B, then I'm not gonna f with her because my loyalty does lie with you. Say you're not friends with Sky. All right, Bianca, I'm not friends with Sky anymore. Nobody's friends with Sky. I'm not friends with Sky. The Sky. Exactly. The so. bird. The bird. <laughs> Bitch, you the one she threw bread at. Give me a hug. Get up. Get up before I drag you up. And give me a hug. And let's go over there with these two hoes. Come on. All of New York has come out to see the hottest females battle it out at Gwinnin Fest. Between BBOD, Young B, and Mariah, man, my lineup is on fire. It's Gwinning Fest, and I'm here to support my potential new artist, Young B. I want to see how she moves on stage and how she acts in front of some of the important players in this industry. My boy Richie D is back in the city, so I brought him out to enjoy some of the festivities. Y'all know he likes to get his hands on some new female talent. Y'all ready for some hip hop, some ladies hip hop? Make some noise in here. Make some noise for Young B. Money. Tonight is a very huge night for me to kill a stage, show Yandy what I'm made of, and secure her as my manager. I knew bum bitches on deck, BBOD was on the lineup, but seeing this ugly bitch Mo just walk on the stage just reminded me about all the things I hate about her. I know we all come from Harlem, but I'm the queen of Harlem, and this ain't no love thy neighbor shit. No, seriously, they better bring it, because I'm about to slaughter they asses. Are y'all ready for these ladies to rip it down? Hey, with it, drop it. Cheer. Any rap chick could get it with no problem. Take it to the streets or to the booth and show rap to the streets. Y'all know I got beat beat. Yeah, I make it rain. Huh, we clear it out. The rings and things she think about, we bring them out. While she was running around, chicken noodle soup in it. I was on the lot picking cop. I felt super rich. Telling the dealers to take the doors in the roof of it. It's BBOD. You are the bras is irrelevant. Yeah. Is she really trying to come for me with those whack ass lyrics? I ain't seen Mo in like five years, but obviously the 15 stitches that I gave her wasn't enough to keep her far away from me. Just wait until it's my turn. I'ma let y'all hear what real talent sound like. Gwen and Hey! I'm like, woo! I turn my siren on. Look around and see who I'm firing on. I'm the eye of the storm and you dying alone. You all the money, you belong in a retirement home. Ain't nobody worried about that little snowflake over there, though. I just came to put a bitch back in your place. Keep my name in their mouth like it's Colgate. Head back, tongue out, catch a snowflake. Woo! I came out tonight to the Gwyneth Fest to hear some new talent. But what I wasn't expecting to see was my old homie Mariah Lynn on stage. I know Mariah from back in the day. You know we did a little dirt. But back then, she was just a struggling artist. I see not much has changed. Young B is in the building! Queen of Harlem, I've been running the town. It's my city. Never trust a big butt in a snail, but a sits pretty. So hot, so diddy. I'm Billy Rock, born in the block. So train, no war winner. How can I stop him? I'm never stopping. I'm brown skin. I'm popping. They said it's competition. I said, where? I don't see it. These bitches hating. Better get on the line, I said. These bitches hating. I'm good doc, I said that, my wizard, I'm winning all the way to the t t t t And I don't mean to to my own horns, but I said I said I won me awards And I'm only 24, got way more money to get Singing, rapping, dancing, acting, this young mother I've been Since 119 in Lexington, so when I die, I'm a legend Cause my record's a hit, Well, okay, B, if that's how you roll on stage This could be the start to a brand new relationship Talk about killing it? She just tore the whole stage down. Don't come for me. Please don't come for me. BBOT. Thank you for the shout out to Aladdin Rain. It was cute. One record, though. Don't say record. You got one record. What are these broads even talking about? Not one of them have a record on the radio but me. Put two fingers up for peace. It's some awards in Holland. Please. Everybody get home safe. Quit it, fast. BBOD just killed the Gwinnin' event. And B, you ain't have a hit in a decade. It's time for you to get a new record. She may think this performance is over, but it's just the beginning, honey. Listen, it's bitches like old. you should want to be a friend of me and not an enemy. 
I'm telling you. You're a joke. Like, no, for real. Seriously. No, you're nothing a joke. Nothing a joke. This cold conversation is a joke. All right, so what are we talking about? If we're not, it, if have we're not talking about money. Daughter, how what? Daughter, how what? Kids, so kids, I give kids, you 15 kids. more stitches. Right. Daughter, how what? Daughter, how right. what? Right. Don't come for me because right. you're not about that life. Daughter, how what? Don't get us. We're here to show off our talents, not some hood Mo is completely out of control, and we need to get the hell out of here before we make a fool of ourselves any more than we already have. Cause you're not about Don't that get life. Don't get your, and bitch, what? you not about Daughter that life, what? bitch. Daughter Daughter get what? Your... This bickering back and forth has turned a serious showcase into amateur hour. If this is how Young B represents herself in public, I need to think long and hard about taking her on as a client, cause I'm not in the business of no mess and no drama. Oh, I will f you up, I'm Good dead. Dead. Bum bitch. And I will do it again. And you was getting that ass fucked. And I will do it again. Don't get looked about. B, you live in a project, you bum bitch. Projects, bitch, you talking about. You got a Harachi bitch with a homemade shirt, with a homemade weed, with a homemade weed. And I will bust your open again. You lucky security is right here, because I will bust your open again. Bye, ladies. Bye, gentlemen. Work the pole, girl. Work the pole. <laughs> Ever since I took this etiquette class with Tyra, all I want to do now is white people activity. So I invited Mariah and Bianca to take glass blowing classes with me. I mean, I know Tyra ain't gonna want to be blowing on something else. <laughs> That was a cute activity and it all was. that, but I'd rather be blowing some cash. Well, you know what I'm saying? We gotta do different stuff. Why is it that every single time I link up with Bianca, she got the same hairstyle as me? We look like two sisters with two different fathers. When we was in that etiquette class and everything, we were sipping tea and whatnot. Y'all took an etiquette class? Yeah. And you know, if we hang with the white folks, we act like the white folks, and that's what we finna do. I love Cardi B. She always know how to keep it popping and lit. I was really excited to hear that she invited Young B along. I haven't seen her since the Cypher, and the first impression was kind of rocky. One thing I do know is she got a problem with these same bad breath on holes, just like I do. The last time I seen you was at the, the point in fact. With all yes. that chaos and all exactly. that. Exactly. You look exactly. like you was about to pop off. I got my own issues with them girls. Like, I really do. I started working with Ra, so she asked me to perform at her fashion show, okay. and I was living in my glory, super happy. Right. As I go backstage, she like, oh, who you? Right off the bat, already barking. Bitch, if you want bark and not bite, stay your ass in that doghouse. Put a muzzle on that bitch. Do something because I'm not the one. Right. Yeah. I told you she look white, but she don't act like one. Right, huh? right. Yeah. The Puerto Rican will come out of me. You want us to hang out with the snow bunnies, but she acting. But she ain't a snow bunny. She Puerto Rican and whatnot. You know she's Spanish. I ain't worried about the Lexi girl now for Mo. I'ma see her on sight. Give her a fresh ass whoop. And if you need any help, you just tag me in. You heard? I'm trying to be on my best behavior. I can't be hanging out with y'all. How ironic is that? Y'all yeah, both got be with the same old bitches. And y'all said blowing glass wasn't interesting. <laughs> well, listen, Cardi, thank you for inviting me to this yes. class. Oh, 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 it's oh. keeping me on track with this whole etiquette thing you know we gotta do. But I wanna invite y'all to the studio again so I can let y'all hear some of my new because my new music is fire. All right, girl, well, as long as it's not in the weekend, I'm finna be in that studio with you. With it? And man, we go all work together, son. You never know. You know Turn what I'm saying? That's what I does. I networks. I networks. That's right. <laughs> now, if you excuse me, I gotta go use the bathroom. And by the way, I fought it. <laughs> Bitch! Ew! Mo! Money! Tell me that. Yes! I hear two different stories. So why you wanna do me like that? Yeah. Why you wanna do me like that? Just give him some time, but now it's like the time that he's giving his mom. Fast forward the process, skip the rewind. Cause I ain't with the game, boy, you out of your you mind. I see his mind is somewhere else. And so what he's giving to me went to someone else. He think he's playing me, but he's playing himself. But he know it's something different by the way that I felt. But tell me that. BBOD! Yes, baby, BBOD is back together. And impressing a label like Def Jam as a duo can only mean great things for Mo and I. I know that together we can be unstoppable. No, I need y'all to make more noise than that! 
Mo and Lexi getting back together is just as fraudulent as those asses they wear. Make some noise for Mariah Lynn! Never bitch. Things that you do, you'll be never rich. Never popping, you'll be never it. You're way at the top, but better never live. Never bitch. Never bitch. Never, ever, 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 ever bitch. Never bitch. Never bitch. Never, ever, 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 ever bitch. Run from you? Never. Number two, never. I guess don't get the chatter. You need to get your together. Woo! Never bitch. I'm on the average dollars at the judges' table is only telling me that I need to work double hard. And I'm coming for one person only. Miss No Money. You wanna be lit? <laughs> bitch, never. Please, never, ever, ever, ever. Make some noise for Mariah Lydia! I'm really worried about Mariah's performance right now. Come on, this is a joke. Make some noise for Signature! All my life I've been dead, bitch. Yeah. Oh, all my life I've been dead. Yeah. All my life I've been dead, bitch. Yeah. Oh, all my life I've been dead. I love my life. Kaya, yeah. baby! I've been doing this for a while. Doing it, bitch, bitch, for a while. And golly is all I could be. Keep checking for me on the screen. They stay scheming for a riffing tree. So whoever was sleeping better wake up. Cause I'm here for a reason like I'm Nick Buck. In a trap for a season better keep up. Get my whole team eating, we mixed up. Just a little couple sex, I'm down. And I gotta make it back like how. No, I ain't about to let shut down. Oh, hold on, on my back right now. Just stay around and I'm back to say you're my friend. Hey, hey, you know me, I'll be coming. I'm talking to Fry. This performance was alright. But is she lip singing? I do not envy these judges right now. All these ladies did a great job, but guess what? There's only one number one. I heard BBOD, didn't I mean, they? Yeah, was close, but BBOD. Here go my thing. DBOD had a lot more crowd participation. It was confident. Okay. They had presence. They had presence. Well, we don't agree with you. I even like when Mariah Lynch was at. Never, never. My my at you. My my at you. Hello, Miss Thing. Oh, look at you. Hi. Me and Bianca, we tore that stage down tonight. And if I don't win this thing, she better. Cause Lord knows these bum bitches didn't bring anything but dumpster juice. Straight trash. We're just trying to see what's going on backstage. Um, what's up? Nothing. You did a great job. You you look real good. You, oh, you did. You, you seem a little high style today. But um, you know, I got some. I figured I'd just show you for myself. Okay. What's this? Oh, I guess little Miss Lexi don't know that her partner in crime is a bona fide snitch. I was gonna hold it until Mo got feisty, but <laughs> I just couldn't help myself. Bianca Supri, Monisha Brown. Okay, where's her signature? What is this? Her name is right there. Oh, shit. I know exactly what that is. My girl Mariah is too funny. Yo, you got Mo restraining order on me front and center. Come on, Mo. What you gotta say now? Okay, but well, what is this? I'm confused. You're a snitch. Bitch, yeah. Yeah, let's get it pop, bitch. Come on, bitch. Let's get it pop, bitch. What you talking about? What's up? Only a weak ass bitch walks around acting like a G, but really is a rat. Bitch, take your ass back to the hole that you came from. Why do y'all hold me? Listen. Why do y'all hold me? Stupid ass blue ponytail. Let's see. The girls got me up. Here she go again. If they think they gonna clown more money, huh, they about to find out. Baby, bye bye. It's fine. You kept it real cute. Yeah. It's fine. No, no, not tonight. Boom, bow, bitch. Kaboom, Ding. kaboom. Pull the track out. Hey, 
Winning Selfs Gwinning Fest opened up a lot of opportunities for me. One of the prizes that I won was this track from Amadeus, one of the hottest producers in the game. He's worked with everybody from Chris Brown, Trey Songz, Remy Ma, Fabulous, French, J-Lo. I'm so grateful to have the chance to work with him. This is so exciting to me to really work with you, and I'm just grateful for this opportunity. You know, like, a producer like you is just, it's just crazy to work with. I'm ready, I got you, I got okay. you. Hey! Right. What's up? Uh, what's thank up? you, oh, yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. Uh -oh, what's going on? I'm so excited that Bianca won the Granny Fest. Shorty is really talented. She deserves all of that. However, here goes Bianca again, having my same goddamn hairstyle. Like, goddamn it! Damn! It's cool, though. You know what I'm saying? We could be cute, fake-looking sisters and whatever the crap. Let's skip to some drama. What happened there? Because I know I heard about a couple of things. You missed the circus, because the clowns came to town at that showcase. What happened? Whole money, no money, more money, whatever her name is. <laughs> Remember that little, little secret I had dug up from the dirt? Right. Well, I put that right on my bra. Like, I whipped it out, and she, she tried to pop on me, but she was a little too... Listen, listen now, she's not popping you because you skinny and whatnot, you weigh like 100 pounds. This is what I'm like about ugly bitches. They always want to fight somebody. But I want to hear about no more and Lexi no more. It's like, why are you trying to be a thug? Like, your thug record is over. Like, ain't nothing that you could do to recuperate the fact that you got all protection. Enough about them bozo-ass hyenas. Why you want beef with small little tiny Mariah? Why you didn't want her to pop off on Bianca when you saw her in the studio? That's some punk goofy cat <laughs> But I, if I was there, I would have started a riot. <laughs> Welcome back to Love and Hip Hop The Reunion. And right now I'm joined by Mariah Lynn, Mo, and Cisco. After having his luck run out with women last year, Cisco decided to take his chances with a new relationship this season. But the Mo women that he got tangled up with, the Mo problems he found himself left with. Take a look. I've been dating this hot producer for a couple months now, and things have been going really good for us. He's exactly the type of guy I'm looking for. I got a new client coming in today, and I'm excited. Looking forward to making some new magic. I would love to hang out with you. Yeah, so let's get together soon. I'm with it. You have beautiful eyes, you know that? Thank you. I really like them. You mind if I take a better look at them? No, mm, that's fine. Linking up with Cisco was a good move for my career. It also doesn't hurt that he's sexy as hell. I know I'm late to the party, but I'm happy I made it just in time to see my girl Mo killing on that stage. You came on late. My bad, man. I thought I had a session that ran late. Hey! Got to working together? This is my boo. Yeah. Oh, that's your boo? Yeah, I know. I didn't know that. You know, we kind of been macking a little bit. Oh. This goes now dating you. He's not dating Mo. Okay, well, I didn't know Y'all got me f***ed up. Mo, how long were you two actually dating? Um, just a couple of months. Couple months. Okay. Nothing too serious. Okay. It wasn't serious, but you did seem a little upset to find out he was dating other women. So if it wasn't serious, were you guys still seeing other people? Well, you know what it was? Um, besides us dating, me and Cisco, Cisco got really cool, like, okay. as a, on a friendship level. Okay. And I felt like he was down for me. Okay. Cisco, do you feel like you led Mo on some? I think I was pretty uh, clear with Mo in, in the sense where it was like, yo, you know, at that moment, I wasn't really looking for a relationship. So I think if you happened... wasn't looking for a relationship, why tell me not to date anyone else? You told her that? Let's not play the tape for my prior sit down. Um, Where well, you cook for me. OK? You cooking? Let's not get up. Yeah. I do cook, yeah. OK. Listen, I, I don't remember saying that, but you know. OK. I'm, I'm... She's saying? I don't remember saying okay, that. OK, we got will... old timers. We know you're a little old, but yeah. let's not forget it. Mariah, let me ask you, why did you have an issue with Mo at the party? My issue with her was that she said, well, Cisco can't work with anybody but me. And I felt like she jumped on me, and when she slapped the drink out of my hand, that was violation. Wrong place, okay. wrong time. Did you? That's you why just felt I like you could bully you. her because she weighed like no, 100 baby, pounds. No, baby, darling. I didn't feel like... No, bitch, go. don't okay. start with me because I will What's find your ass. Both y'all bitches is pussy. Oh, don't talk because you pussy. You mad pussy. You mad pussy. Shut the Okay. You should get right. not getting out of my Mo. character. Mo. Cardi, let me ask you a question. One second, everybody, please. I don't need nobody. One second, Mariah. Right. 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 We know you like to talk. 
Ladies, we gotta talk one like, at a time. Like, we're not Party, doing let me this ask today. Everybody has a problem with BBOD. You feel like Everybody. BBOD is a group, you feel like they bully her because she's yeah, tiny? Yeah, because she's like, you know, come her little pounds and that whatnot. Like, you always try to come but at people Lexi or whatever. Wasn't even, Lexi wasn't even there when I, I was dealing, right. and, when I was dealing with Mariah. And Riley's like, different. You wasn't there, so why your business? was different. But you was mad pussy, though. You was mad pussy, though. Out of here, you and you all about my way though. Like, like, like out of here. No, you out of here because you all contradicting right. yourself, Mariah, saying you never spoke relax. about my weight. Okay, when in the first about? episode, clearly you said she like five pounds. I will okay, pass her and blow her away. Well, bitch, blow, huff what and puff and try to get the down. Get the What's up, bitch? She need, she's gonna get diabetes. How salty she is. Bitch. We relax. Me and the Stop playing with me, my Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. Let's go, Lex. Run their mouth. Too much, yo. Sit down. Too much running their mouth. Hey. Oh, my God. You look so cute. Look at you. Yes. Yes. Look at the silver Thank you. Bitch, you got your teeth done? I so did, bitch. <laughs> I really, really did, And you did said though. you was not getting them done. You know what? People keep talking about it, like, oh my god, get your teeth fixed, get your teeth fixed. And, like, money was never the problem. It's just, like, I felt comfortable, but I guess America don't like when people feel comfortable or don't love themselves. So, all right, I fix them. Now nobody talking shit. Now what y'all gonna say about me? Nathan, because I look popping. Every goddamn word. Perfect. And I feel pretty. Let me tell you what happened to me the other day. That's you, darling. So I had a big ass performance. Andy come run down on me. She like, oh, let me introduce you to this DJ. And it's DJ Drewski from Hot 97. The white one? Yes. I used to talk to him mad long ago. Really? You like white men? That's yes. what you into? I never had sex with a white man. I never even had sex with nobody that's lighter than my skin complexion. You know I what I'm saying? I never had sex with him either. No, I'm just saying, if you get some, if you get some of the white penises, let me know. I'm curious. Maybe I'm having you sex with the, the wrong race. You will be the first to know. <laughs> Crazy. Oh, well then, thank you very much. <laughs> Cardi always got to take it there. Why I go talk to this girl? She's talking about white penis. I knew Juicy like mad long. We used to talk a long time ago. Like he'd pull up on me, uh, like mad flirting, like kissing, you know, but it never got that far because he always had mad girls. Come to find out, he got a girl. Like, how you being mad extra still and you got a girlfriend? Like, or he said it's his assistant. But do you know, like him? Yeah, I mean, it's, I, I think so. I'm gonna take him from her. <laughs> I mean, I'm trying to. That's the Harlem thing to do. I'm surprised that Bianca went, you know, from chocolate to white chocolate, but I said she not sure that Drewski has a girlfriend or an assistant. Why don't you be the assistant to his penis then? You better get what you want, girl. You better go get that white chocolate. Besides being my girlfriend, Sky and I are actually business partners. On the music front, she assists me with my DJing and my bookings, but as a couple, we want to take it further than just my career. Sky is a fitness enthusiast. With her expertise in fitness and my expertise in music, we put it together and created a new business venture called Strip and Fitness. I need a space for the DJ setup. Yeah, like I wanted you on a stage. Strip and Fitness is my baby. It's my passion. I work really hard to create it. I actually lost 60 pounds on my own with fitness and healthy eating. And I want to teach people how to do the same thing. So I wanted to create this strip-inspired workout in a club atmosphere to get people happy, active, social, one party at a time. Can't fit 50 people in here, though. You're trying to get 50 people to come. 50 people is a lot of people. Who's that? Huh? Who's that? Bianca. OK. You don't want to finish talking? You can answer. After running into Bianca at the performance the other night, I thought she was going to keep it professional. But she keep blowing my phone up. Texts, phone calls, voicemails. I don't mind a little innocent flirting when it comes to artists, but now she hitting me in front of my girl. Put it on speaker. Bianca. What's up, Drewski? I was in a studio the other night and I made this record. Like, I was thinking about you and the record is called Miss You. Like, the hook is like, Texting, I miss you. 
You inspired me. What are you talking about? You can't miss my man or want to kiss my man. I know these two have dealt with each other in the past, but Juski swore it was strictly in the past. Bianca's disrespecting me, and Juski's putting up with it. I need to get with you because I need you on a song. It's a, right. it's a song Sky inspired. It's called Make It Official. Oh, your assistant. My girlfriend. Yeah, um, the other night you called her your assistant. I gotta go. I'm gonna I hit you. We'll get together. All right, whatever. All right. Bye, Bianca. Bye, Andrew. Why are you tripping? Why are you tripping? Like, why? Really? She knows you got a girl, and she's still trying to... There's nothing more than the music. What is... I need to get her on a record. Mm -hmm. So why are we arguing? Why is she taking energy out of us? That's the artist you've had a past with. Sky got this whole thing wrong. I entertain artists like Bianca because I'm in the music business. And as one of the hottest DJs out here, it all comes down to relationships. So let me handle the music, and she can handle all the stripping fitness stuff she wants. That's more her speed. As my girlfriend, mm -hmm. if I'm working, that has nothing to do with you. Wow, OK. Yes, because now you owe Dan. I don't feel respected. I did feel I, like I'm not did respected. Did I call that girl? It doesn't matter. What are you leading her on for? Like, Young B needs to be checked. Check her, or I'm gonna check her for you. Juski thinks he could disrespect me by flirting with Bianca right in my face, and then invite her to be on the record that he dedicated to me, his girl. Oh, hell no, we not doing that. I think I should have a say on who gets on it, and I have somebody else in mind. The last couple months have been really good to Mariah Lynn. After getting mixed up in all the drama last year with the Creep Squad and getting my mother back on her feet, I could finally say that me and my music are in a great place. I ended my business relationship with Ra Lee, so I'm proud to announce that I'm a free agent. I'm officially calling my own shot. Hey, baby. Hello. How are you? I met Sky at an industry party a few months back, and we hit it off. She seems like she's a down-ass bitch, like a cool new addition to the squad. Matter of fact, I was hoping that this newfound bond would put me front and center with her boo, DJ Drewski. How you been? I've been great. Everything business-wise, good. Just trying to take it to the next level okay. for me, for the well, that's future. Good. Happy to hear that. Mariah's a very sweet girl. I think she's a great artist, and I definitely know that she's about her business and making money. She's not out to take anybody's man. Plus, I'm a big fan of her music. Girl, let me sip some wine. What's going on with you? You know I lost like 60 pounds. Congratulations, and I wanna baby. Thank you, and I want to help people do the same. So trying to start a business. It's going to be a fitness party okay. at a club, and I need you to be there for the launch party. OK. How are you and Drew doing? Uh, me and Drew are not really like vibing right now. The other day we were scouting a location. We get there and some girl calls. I told him to put on speaker, so he puts on a speaker. And she's talking about, I miss you, I want to kiss you, like. Oh no, sounds like I want to lick you, I want to you. I want to My God, that's the next step, right. I guess. But get this, he got a track that he wants her to be on. But it's, it's a song that's for me. It's called Make It Official. Oh, OK. So like a dedication, it's a dedication to you. dedication to me. With this new bitch that's on it. I'm thinking maybe Mariah Lynn could be on a track. You want me to be? Ah! I'm all about women helping other women, especially if it's all about exposing these other hoes trying to take another woman's man. But I'm a little weary about getting in the middle of Sky and Drewski's mess. Drewski's a very important person in this industry, especially for artists like me. And I'm not trying to mess that up. How do you think Drew is going to feel about this? Because, girl, you know I need my record spinned on Hot 97. We'll get, we'll get there, right? He'll, he'll, he'll get with it when he's ready to. Right. I just got to put it in his face a little bit more than usual. Well, cheers to getting this bag together, because you know cheers I keep that bag on me, girl. Record. And them bars. <laughs> It's real. It is real. It's Strip amazing. and fitness. Are you ready? <laughs> I can't believe it's coming to life like this. Tonight, me and my girl Sky are throwing a launch party to celebrate our next business venture, Strip and Fitness. The turnout is amazing, but the turn up is about to get real when I jump on the ones and twos. I'm going to go turn up. All right, please do. Go thank everyone for coming. I will. 
Cardi and I are front and center at Sky and Drewski's launch party because I'm determined to figure out what's going on with the record that Sky brought to me. I wanted to give Sky the benefit of the doubt in hoping that she didn't give me a record that belongs to my friend. Look who's over there. Nice skin Drewski. Oh, I know, the cup of milk. Do you actually did the track with him? Not yet. She Not yet? Nope, she hasn't shown me the track, so. Drew was pushing for, for Bianca to do the record. Like, that's what she told me. I think she kind of asked you to do the record, like, you know, to be messy, you know what I'm saying? Oh, Drewski, how do a white boy like you get in so much trouble? You must have a lot of black friends. <laughs> I'm just going to mind my neck. That's what I'm going to do. Cardi already put me on that Sky was on some bull and we put two and two together. The track that Drewski gave me to get on is the same track that Sky gave to my friend Mariah Lynn. So tonight it's time to see about this assistant Sky chick and see what's really going on. Y'all look cute, y'all look cute. It's trio with the bangs. Oh my God. <laughs> so like, I'm her senior, right? <laughs> You gonna mess my makeup up for real? You mess it up. I just want everybody to do this. You up. That's you what I want everybody to do. The three of us got the same hairstyle. Oh my god, we look like we be calling each other like, hey, you gonna wear this wig today? But it's cool though, as long as we all against the op. Juicy line, traveling ass, and his girlfriend. Mm hmm. Tonight is supposed to be about the launch of my business with Drewski. And out the corner of my eye, I see somebody that wasn't invited. I know Bianca's not here crashing my party with a blue helmet on. But Drewski wants me to mix and mingle with our guests, so that's what I'm going to do. Hi, ladies. Hey. How are you, baby? I'm What's good. Going? I'm Sky. This is Hi, Kai. Nice to meet you. I'm sure What's you up? already know Bianca. Hi. Hi. Woman that wants to win. know me. You talking about you know me. I don't know you. You do know me. No, I don't. Oh, yes, you do. No, I don't. You do. You call my man. You know me. And your man calls me. My man does. Never call you. Well, you need to check when? his call log and know Juicy for years. Okay, but so I'm you're his girl. a girl. You're and his, his assistant. assistant. Okay, cool. And the bitch that you need to talk okay, to cool. if you want your music played. That will shut your whole down well, if you want your music He's still playing my music. Because I let him. But oh, I can really? shut that whole okay, well, you should really be worried about him to. making money and not right, shutting yeah, it yeah, down if you're his assistant. Anyway. Why are you so sure that your man is not hitting her up? Yeah. Hitting her up for what? Chocolate. Well, when he hit her up. Because he want to taste chocolate. He's tasted it before, I'm sure. Well, he wants some of us. You tried to kiss him. He wants some of us. You tried to kiss him. I've kissed him. Many a time. I've kissed Juicy many a time. Was you there? Was you there? Were you there? I was not there, but I know she ain't gonna lie to me about no. I'm telling you she's lying. I'm lying about you. But he's lying to her about you. Let's see. Baby, you wanna come over here and tell him? I see Bianca, Cardi B, Mariah Lynn, and Sky. And things looking like it's getting heated. I need to get over there quick and make sure things don't go left. Especially in my party. This ain't the time and place for this. First of all, Juicy don't even play because she came over here being crazy. I'm okay, not with the I'll, bullshit. I'll, she came I'll, over I'll, here and turned the I'll, up I'll, talking I'll, about my career is over. I'll, Bitch, my records is gonna get played from Paul. My home. You better think again before you come for my career. Like, go and find some paperwork or go get some coffee. Grab me a latte. Extra frap with my Bitch. Don't call my man because he don't want your Stop calling my man. That's what I'm gonna tell you right now. Calm the Damn. Please, Damn. please, please, this is our Damn. event. She don't know you, you don't know her. No, but yeah, you know what? Actually, both of them know each other. Well, because you know what I'm saying? Like, you supposedly want to put Lil Mariah Lynn over here on the record that he wants to give her to be petty because he want to give her the record. I'm confused. Sky gave Mariah Lynn my record? Why is she calling somebody else to say get on the record because she's being petty about me calling you? I knew white men are just as messy as black oh, men. Oh, I knew yeah. it. I knew Worse. it. I knew it. That's why I don't mess with y'all. If you want to do business, then contact me. Come and holler at me. And I'm still going to call him. But you sound like a home wrecker. Come on, home wrecker. Like You're not home married home to him. Home. You're not playing her music no more. It's a rap. Go have a so different stupid. DJ play your you music. You sound so stupid. Have a different DJ you play your music, so bitch. And you won't be on that track either because yeah. Mariah's going to be on that track. Me and Sky are cool. But me and Bianca are real friends, and I don't want to have to slap a bitch. But at the end of the day, I'm going to try to stay neutral. I have I bet you I do be yet, on it. So. I bet you I right, do be I'm on it. Right off. I, we will see. All right. We will cool. see. Ugh, this walking in the beach is not for me. I got all them goddamn clothes on. This is the beach, hello. I am conservative. Yeah. When these girls invited me to the beach, I don't care how I was dressed, I was gonna go. Because the stress of me being on tour and that whole drama with Swift and his dumbass bimbo bitch, Asia, has bring me so much goddamn stress, I need to relax with these bitches. Them white boys looking at y'all. 
Why they can't be looking at you? Hi. <laughs> you want to get your <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Yo, I'm out of here. You like <laughs> Oh, my God. I'll make you like me right now. I see some white penis over there in the beach and everything. It's like, let me have some fun with them. I mean, I got to deal with a penis that I'm not even sitting on, which is Swift. Do you know my producer, Swift? Yeah. Oh, boo. After our big show, I see his shorty talking wild crazy uh -oh. about me. Nah. And I told oh, her, like, no. yo, as soon as she opened her mouth, I just popped on her. I just felt so betrayed. So, you know, I don't think he wants to work with me again. And it's just terrible because he's the only one that understands my he music. He wants to still work with you. They always come back. Uh-huh. Where you and Tommy at right now? You know, me and Tommy, we've been having a lot of problems because he don't really support my music like that. Every single time that I told him, like, oh, my God, look, my music charted on Billboard. Oh, my God, look, I got this crazy deal on the table. And they hit me with the sarcastic shit, like, oh, my God, look, you haven't come visit me in six months. You don't have no time to do stuff when you're working and got businesses and getting money. When you right. are a bum, you got all the time in the world. So he want a bum or he want somebody that's getting money. Bianca's right. Tommy don't really understand what he got. I have a life, I'm a pretty bitch, and I need to get this bread. What's up with you hoes? Girl, you know Sky. Um, you still hanging out with the ops. Man. Betrayal. Wait, look, <laughs> I'm go. neutral between y'all two. I don't got love for no op bitches, but she's a sweet she's girl. A so I brought Sky to this event that Soph invited me to. You know, he was bragging about this whole big, huge announcement for the Gwen and Team Entertainment. So I'm like, oh, so let me show up to the event because you know my name is going to be in that mother announcement because I'm going to be the first Lady Gwynnin. So we're there, we drinking, whatever, and he announces this artist to the stage. I'm listening to the girl sing or whatever. I'm like, all right, whatever. Until she said she was first Lady of Gwynnin. Skirt, skirt. Dun, now, dun, dun. <laughs> skirt, skirt. <laughs> I'm supposed to be first Lady of Gwynnin. But you want to know something right quick? That is good for your ass. If so couldn't do nothing for me, what the hell you think he going to do for somebody else? Mariah Lynn talking about that she gonna work with DJ Self, and I'm just over here like, oh my God. You know, me and Self been a little rocky because I had there heard rumors that he trying to say like, I put Cardi on, I practically made Cardi. And it's like, you made Cardi, I'm Self made, baby. I was just hurt at the fact that Self is dishonest as hell with me in that moment. I don't know what the future holds for me and Self, but an apology would be a good start. Y'all already know I was talking to Drewski, her whack ass friend Sky, boyfriend. I'm painting my house and I'm gonna be in a hotel for a few weeks. So I think I'ma invite him over there and see what's really good. Oh my God! Me and Drewski been flirting really hard the past few weeks. The record is done, so we got our business out the way. So now I'm trying to see what else we could collaborate on. And I give zero f if Sky or her little best friend Ryland knows about it. So what about this girlfriend thing? Oh. His girlfriend. Oh, so that's how you feel now? That's, that's how she playing it. That's how you come Tell back. your friend I said what's it. really good. I'm telling my what's friend. good? Yes, what's really, really good? Friend. I'm telling my friend. That's it. Tonight is the night I'm going to bag DJ Drewski. He doesn't know it yet, but when he come by to show me that artwork, I'm going to show him something that he never going to forget. I hope he's ready to make it official because tonight is going down. And I don't care who knows it. Hey, what's up? When Bianca invited me up to the hotel room, I knew it was a little weird. But now she's standing in front of me, half-ass naked. Now I know this is a bad idea. I'm not trying to make things awkward, but I do got some business to handle. So I'm going to just stick to the business and end this little meeting as fast as possible. But Lord. Please help me. When you told me to meet you here, I thought we was going to the bar. I didn't know you had me up here, like, in your room. What are you doing in a hotel room? My apartment is being renovated, so I'm in a hotel. OK, I guess it makes sense to why we're here. But I'm still wondering why she got no clothes on. So I got the record. Let me uh, show you the artwork. Tell me what you think. That's cute. My name could have been a little bit bigger, but. Your name is fine. Your name is Yo. What's it all that about? What's all what about? What? <laughs> and now somebody's knocking on your door. Saved by a knock at the door, thank God. I gotta get up out of here quick, because if Sky knew I was here, I would probably be a dead man. Mm. It's for you. For me? Yo, what's going on right now? Maybe Bianca got some strippers coming over I didn't know about. 
because I'm actually a little nervous to know what's going on behind door number one. Oh. What the is going on here? Nothing is Why going on. Why are you here? You got lipstick on your f***ing lip. Where at? Juski must think I'm a fool. White Chocolate better have a good excuse as to why he showed up to this hotel room, or I'ma go ham on him. I ain't even doing that. I came here. What the f she's wearing? You playing thought scotch with this bitch? I'm playing nothing. That scotch, mom. Do not play yourself. Your man been giving me all the signals for me to know that that white chocolate wants some of this milk chocolate. You stupid. Juski's actually entertaining this chick that's trying to push up on him, and he can't deny it. He's caught because it's all over his face, and I'm done with this Can I talk to you for a second, please? I came here mm -hmm. to show her the artwork. It's not like I... lipstick on your face. Okay, she she's was excited naked. about this. When you walked in, I'm fully dressed. My sneakers are still on. So what happened? She was excited about the record. She and went she to give me a hug. She kissed me. It ain't like... That's what I happened. kiss her. I did not kiss her. Like, I don't know what to tell you. I apologize. I know you don't know what to tell me. I'm not even... I don't know oh, what you like, about. You want me to compete with a hoe. Like, I'm a queen. I'm not doing that. I'm here for you, right? Okay. All the I'm time. Here for work. No, you're here, here because you want to get something. I don't know why you would be in a hotel. That's not work. God. That's not work. I don't even know what to say right now. Like, this ain't even my fault. I'm, so I'm what you, what do you think to... happened? I didn't even come for this. Like, and now I think I lost my woman, the one I actually love. tour performing every night. I've been working so hard and my management team haven't given me a break. So I ran this hotel room and I'm going into heighten. You know what I'm saying? Here comes Bianca calling me. But you know what? Bianca don't know none of my managers. She ain't gonna tell nobody where I'm at. <laughs> hey, why go on that Hey, you in a tub, you gonna be all screwed up like a fool. So what you been up to? Remember that day when we was at the beach or whatever, I told you I was going to um, invite you to the hotel. Uh-huh, girl. How it went down? He came, and I'm in my bra panties or whatever. Wait, you was in your bra and panties? I was chilling. You know, I'm like, all right, pull up, listen to the record. They him, gave him a kiss or whatever. In the mail? Yeah. Yeah, bitch. Go get that white chocolate supreme vanilla cone. No, so anyway. After this happened, Sky popped up out of nowhere. Like, oh, you for plays and all this old, you son of a and all. She just keeps talking crazy. I'm like, how does she know I'm here? Like, I mean, you know, she is his assistant. So, you know, she probably saw text I, messages, I, emails. I don't think, but she's she dumb. Like, she not that smart. Mariah told her. Mm, this is messy, messy, messy. Yeah, it's real, man. I love Mariah, but if she ain't moving right, I don't know. Bianca and Mariah, they both my friends. So I'm just gonna mind my neck and mind my goddamn business. But I'm definitely gonna get some popcorn because it's sure gonna be a schmoovie. It's time to say that and forth with these Damn, well, I, I really want you and Mariah to work out, but I think you gotta give her an ultimatum. As a fact. Mariah Lynn been acting mad funny all of a sudden she befriending the ops, hanging out with Sky. Like, we don't rock with snitches, mama. So why you running around telling all my business? Now, me and Drewski business is totally ruined. Thank you so much, New York. I love ya. You are opulent. Thank you, babies. My performance was crazy. And I'm so happy that Bianca made it out because we haven't caught up in a very long time. Hi, baby. So, why you look like that? Your face look all crazy and whatnot. I'm not really with the today, like. Okay, um, so what's good? Speak your mind. It's funny how I'm at the hotel and Sky come pop up Ooh. where I'm at, you know what I'm saying? So yeah. I'm like, only person I could have told her is Mariah because I know she hang out with Mariah. And I'm like. Yes, I did tell her. That's some funny you know what I'm saying? Like at the end of the day, why wouldn't you give me a heads up that you're my right? friend mm -hmm. and I'm building a bond with Sky. Mm. So I'm kind of in the middle of it and I felt like, damn bitch, watch your man. Out of the kindness of my heart, out of being a woman and feeling her pain. Bitch, how you talking about being a woman and feeling her pain? You're my bitch. But still, that's her man, Bianca. I don't give a f if that's her man. Like, that's wrong. I don't give a f if that's her man. My man is not going to be playing with other bitches. My man's going to know what's up. It's for general know what's up. principle, Bianca. I don't give a f I don't like her. So you have a problem with me for being friends with her? Yes, I do. 
You trying to build a bond with a bitch that I don't f with. Scott don't even know you like that. Oh, don't no, she about knows me. No, she, she knows don't. Me. No, she, she don't. don't know no, me, she no, don't. Me. no, she don't. No, she don't. No, she don't. You really just try to hit me, bitch? You gotta f with me, bitch. You wanna f still lick on me, bitch? I promise you I'm gonna see you in the street, too. Shut the f up. Get I swear to God, Bianca, this is real now, baby. Bianca coming to my performance and trying to check me because I messed up her master plan to try to take Drewski away from his own girl is super whack because she knows how important this is to me. I'm gonna f her up. I swear to God, I'm gonna f her up. Like, why she ain't pop? Why you ain't punched me in my face? Why you threw a drink? If you felt some type of way, why you gonna try to mess up my mother Caucasian makeup, bitch? I'm over Mariah Lynn with these apps. She's a backstabber because if she was a real friend, she would have had my back. I was just hoping that I quenched Mariah thirst after I gave her a couple drinks because she was looking real thirsty. I'm done with this chick for good. Yandy blew me out to paradise to get a little writing done, and I'm gonna do that. But don't think that this trip is gonna be all work and no fun. That's it, girl. So Bianca manager Yandy invited her to Mexico, and then Bianca invited me and my sister. Now y'all know I'm about to turn Mexico up. Ay, 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 ay. What Bianca don't know is I did some goddamn inviting on my own. Invite, invite, invite. Surprise, surprise, ho. Really? Why? You know what? Boy, what is she doing here? The I'm more here. the better. I'm here. With all the drama that I've been going through, I needed to get out of New York ASAP. So when Cardi invited me to Mexico, I said, let's drink tequila, bitch. I haven't seen Bianca since she threw a whole tray of drinks on me, so we have a lot to talk about. No, Cardi, like, why did you bring her? Like, this is the type of shit I do. Now, me and my sister, we're gonna go over here. Y'all oh. work it out as grown now women. Work it out. Now now out it right work it out. If these two bitches get right back in their bag and get off their goddamn feelings, then we might have some fun in goddamn Cancun. They need to get over this corny ass thing that's going on with Drewski and the girlfriend assistant. I don't know what the hell she is. Well, this is some real whack shit. Like, you knew I was gonna be here. Why you gonna hang out with your real friends? What your you friends? mean, my real friends? Bitch, you supposed to be my real friend. Right, what do you so mean? I'm supposed to be your real friend. Sky said you sent her. Lie. To my hotel. Lie. Exactly. So why would you want to associate Lie. yourself with a liar? I didn't know she threw my name in the mix until Cardi told me, and until you told me and didn't give me a chance to talk and flip on me. I gave you an ultimatum. Why the f is you still hanging out okay, with Okay, Bianca. That's why you had me pissed off. And I get that, Bianca. So skirt skirt, right there. On the strength that I knew her already, I was nice to her. That's not funny, though. All right, and you know what? After talking to Cardi, maybe she kind of used me to kind of get back at you or make you feel some type of way. Listen, I'm a grown-ass woman, and I'm always willing to say when I'm wrong. I aired out Bianca's dirty laundry because I figured it was the right thing to do to protect Skye. And yeah, I may have tipped her off about stuff that was going to go down, but I never said where or when. It's obvious to me now that I was protecting someone who was using me to get back at their man. If you really don't want me to f with her, B, then I'm not gonna f with her because my loyalty does lie with you. Say you're not friends with Sky. All right, Bianca, I'm not friends with Sky anymore. Nobody's friends with Sky. I'm not friends with Sky. The exactly. Sky. The so, birds. The birds. <laughs> Bitch, you the one she threw bread at. <laughs> give me a hug. Get up. Get up before I drag you up. And give me a hug. And let's go over there with these two hoes. Come on. I'm happy me and Bianca are friends again, but that doesn't mean I'm going to forgive her for tossing an entire tray of drinks at me. We're going to cha-cha, we're going to salsa, we're going to do all of that. Well, before we salsa, I'm a little still mad, bitch. <laughs> Now, we're even. So let's turn up, ladies, with or without our wings. came off getting in the goddamn water. She look like a goddamn prisoner. The only time motherfuckers see my braids is when I'm ready to get it popping or I'm ready to have some sex. You know what I'm saying? Not good. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Get off me. 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 This girl is really crazy, yo, but that's why I gotta love her. <laughs> she looked like a wet cat in that wig fell off. 
I still can't believe all the f drama that happened at the video shoot between James R. and Hofia. So I had to call my sis Bianca to talk. I've been planning this dinner so we can spend more quality friend time. What's been going on? How was your date today? Long you look day. like you was working out, girl. I'm just thugging it out, finishing the album, putting the last finishing touches. I'm on my grind, but it really seems like I'm no longer on Yandy's radar. So I'm doing it all myself. And yes, it's extremely exhausting. What's up with you? Got some tea for you. <laughs> What's good? Been dating. This real smooth criminal, James R. I was supposed to be his leading lady in his video, but we was beefing. So I decided to show up to the video shoot and right. support, and right. I see Miss Sophia the Thotty. Yeah, I know I know of Sophia the Thotty. Jaquay, my people, you know, that's like my bro. That's supposed to be his girl, or whatever the case may be. Girl, yeah. she was real concerned about James R when I walked in the room, because this bitch gonna say to me, oh, I thought y'all wasn't together. Bitch, why are you clocking my that doesn't make sense to me. Clock your own because the mileage you got on that, honey, is too much to even calculate, OK? The last thing I remember her saying to me was, you're going to let me talk? And that was a little too strong. So she rolled off the mother bed. Boop. Face down, ass up. I wish I was there. I miss all the good stuff. So anyways, what's been going on? Oh, god. I come meet up with Rich at some industry event or whatever. I'm like, oh yeah, you know, 10 plus, the album is about to come out. He like, I got somebody that you might know or whatever. Out comes Bree at this event. Oh my God, like I can't get away from this bitch. Like I'm trying to just be like, yo, let me just leave it alone because it's not that serious. She talking so much, I'm, I'm, I'm zipping my Giuseppe's down like this and I'm like, not the Giuseppe's bitch. Shoot her face, my Shut the up. And then I went and bumped into Dream Doll. I just want to let you know, she's not your sister, bro. Like, what she, happened? She's like, oh, I wanted to invite you here to talk to you. So I'm like, OK, about what? Because you hang out with Bree. Bree don't like me. She like, I just want to say you wrong. Like, she keeps saying, oh, you a troublemaker. Why is Dream defending somebody who keeps antagonizing you and provoking you? I told her, tell your friend to calm down. She like, I can't tell my friend nothing. If you and Mariah try to jump my friend, it's lit for okay. your ass. Oh, really? Yeah, that she said, that's what she said out her mouth. I see where Dream's loyalty lies at, and it obviously lies with this mother <laughs> Oompa Loompa, Willy Wonka, <laughs> everlasting Bianca Bonnie trying to be bitch. I know Dream is winning, but whether we are label mates or not, if you have beef with my sis and my friend, you are automatically an op of mine. Listen, so Soph is about to be real heartbroken. If his artist even looks at me sideways, I'm going to f Drag that bitch. Mm. Y'all should have been down for it. Now you ain't around for it. Self asked me to meet with Mariah to smooth out any problem she has. For the sake of winning, I'ma give sis the chance. But I'm not really feeling the fact that she's trying to work with my man. Period. So she better talk to me nice, or else there's gonna be a problem. Mariah. What up? In the body, right? Good. What's up? So, Self told me to come to talk to you because I feel like both of us is getting wrapped up in the whole Bianca and Bree situation. I agree. In my opinion, I feel like your friend is starting this. Like, so that's she still heard. Good. That's still between her and Bree. Right. We just need to mind our business, period. Right. Because it's going to get bigger and it's going to start touching my coins, and I'm not with my coins getting touched. I feel like it's already intertwining into the Gwen and what you said to Bianca was that if we were to jump her, that is lit for me. Like, oh, it's lit for her. I said to Bianca that if she jumps my friend while I'm there, I'm jumping in. And then she said, well, you'll be collateral. And I said, and I'll be fighting with my friend. That's what I said. Look, I agreed to do this little kumbaya talk off the strength of self to make Mariah feel a little better about her little music career. But all she wanted to do was talk about the whole Brie Bianca mess. Maybe if you take two steps back from the drama, your career will probably be going a little better, sis. Anyway, Phelps oh, told me to come and talk to you today okay. because your career is going flop.
My career's not gonna flop. Well, that's okay. how your manager feels. Ma, let me that's tell you something. You would have not been but talking to nobody nice if I didn't say go what to me. Self. I left my old job, came to your new job, took your new job. No, you You're didn't. a bum ass bitch. That's exactly what you are. You make no money. You don't even pay self his 20%. That's 15. He does no not my contract. Is, you don't pay it because you don't get booked, bitch. You're overlooked. Your <laughs> is flop. Well, your <laughs> gonna flop from all the <laughs> you take. Oh, your mother. All right, so talk about my mother. Wait, just get me. You When your dude Safari hit me up to work, I originally said for us to do a record together. But now I'ma take him from you. Oh, you wish. He bitch. was on my line last night. Ask about him. Stop don't even fuck on the manager no more. Collaboration. Remy Ma, bitch. That you will never get. You got a a collaboration, bitch. That's why you got kicked in your You're an animal. You don't even write your own music. I'm your worst nightmare, bitch. Remember that. I put you on, I could take you off. Punk ass bitch. I don't know what these girls are trying to accomplish with all this fighting, but I'm trying to get them to focus on the more productive side of life. Not only do they need to squash this beef for the sake of their careers, but also I want them to really come on this trip and be focused on giving back to the people of St. Martin. Hey! What the hell is that? I want no nonsense. We taking off shoes at the door. <laughs> These girls are getting way too out of control. And I'm hoping that we can impart some type of wisdom on them. If they can't sit down in front of each other and have a decent conversation, I don't even think they deserve to know what's at stake which is a trip to St. Martin so we can go and help people that really need our help. Everybody's saying they don't want no problem. Well, good. Or that it's the other party. Hopefully they understand this is a forum to talk. They don't have to be friends, really, but they should at least be able to coexist in the same room, in the same island. Hello. Hey. Hi. Hi. Sit down, sit down. I'm gonna put all shoes in the bin. Come on. She's serious. Oh. I don't know what Yendi was thinking about this whole shoe thing, but throwing shoes have already been done by me. I'm here and that should be enough. But don't get it twisted. I'm not sure about this whole peace and love thing Yendi and Remy got going on. They should be here any minute now. So just so that we can start this off the right way, ladies, come stand with me over here. I'm gonna let them walk in and I feel like we we're gonna take their shoes. I want you to be cool. Bianca, stay right there. Come in. Hello, hey, ladies. Hi, ladies. How y'all doing? How you guys can sit right over here. I'm going to need those shoes. I did not want to come to this meeting today, but I thought that I should listen to my voice so and just come just to hear these women out. This was not my fight, but Mariah made it my fight once she started talking trash about me and my friend Bree. Young queens. Anybody can start. I didn't want this situation to go crazy. Going to fight somebody, that's not even my swag, honestly. Like, I'm really about music. Any way I came at her was in a bar. Yeah, she was spitting about me and her raps. Yeah, I have done that, because that's how I express myself. If you say something in a song, or you post something on Instagram, there's repercussions to that. Everybody not just gonna take, oh, she said whatever, whatever, so she was just expressing herself. You have to be accountable for your actions. Promoters don't want to book somebody that they feel like every time they somebody in their club, it's gonna be a fight. The same way you want to get your bag? The same way the she same wanted to drag right. me, Listen. and that's the whole reason why this Listen. whole started, because she thought she was going to write some Bianca, and I, I must what you have did, been and You know what you did, let's so put what it out there. You're a thot. Everybody, you was in my okay. text messages mm -hmm. talking about me. Okay. You can't nice. admit to I it because you're a professional liar. So do Jesus. something, bitch. What's up, Bianca? Bitch, you're a bitch. Get off me. Now, let me go. We're back with Love and Hip Hop The Reunion. Now, competition may be good for sports, but when rap rivals can't stop running their mouths, there's no winner. Let's take a look. Last time I saw this young lady at my birthday party, she ended up with a hoodie fighting. So I had Bianca sign first. I found Brie. They hate each other with a passion. You still trying to be like me? Oh! So I wanted you to meet with me because I feel like you're wrong for everything you're doing. If somebody say they're gonna drag you, you're not gonna be friendly with it when you see Bianca, you're a thot. You f everybody. You, you was in my oh, text yeah. messages talking oh, about me. So do something so, Bianca, 
I want to know, why did you unstrap the shoe and throw it at her? Because I couldn't get past security. <laughs> that shit is low as no. I, I'm to I Nina. feel like After she, she said she, she wanted to drag me when she see me, it was already lit. It was lit every time. It uh -huh. was never nothing to talk about. So, Gandhi, this has escalated and escalated, and now it seems like even people who were coming in to squash the beef are getting involved. Yeah. It's just really gotten out of control. None of this is supposed to be about this, about the fighting, about the demeaning each other, about the degrading Can each I other. Talk? That's not why we're on the stage. That's not what we're here for. Can I talk? You can. I don't have a problem with you for the okay. thirty thousandth time. If okay. she's saying she doesn't have a problem, can, if you can keep it just saying over? stuff that gonna make me antagonize, like you can't say when I see you, I'm gonna drag you, cause then I wanna fight. It was gonna be a problem when you saw her. I said when I see her, I'm gonna drag her. That's a guarantee fact. Ooh. And when I seen her, I was gonna drag her one on one. I don't gotta jump nobody. It's no rule. Okay. But you jump me. Where was the one on one? Was that you said you wanted to drag me? She doesn't matter. If you was talking about, when I see you, I'm gonna do X, Y, and this. There's no rules, like, you can't jump me, though. You can't sneak me, though. No, no, be prepared. You can't make threats. Yeah. Yeah. This when I catch you, I'm a drag. Is that jump? Like, I feel like I'm being jumped right, right now. Like, I honestly feel like I'm being jumped right now. Like, y'all really like doing a lot. Like, this is just. I'm oh, sorry. Like, this Slow is ass corny. down. Remy, why are you coming because for me, though? Because, because you're sitting here. You why are you set. coming? Because What's I feel like you were just being subliminal. Because you do tell me like that. Stay at the lab, though. Don't come at her like that. I Mariah, her let her talk. Because I want to know she could be like that. So she could come at That's alone. This has been going on for years. Years. I knew Bianca since 2004, when I had blue hair before people was thought of. <laughs> and this was the same that was going on. I blamed Bianca when me and, her and Yandy sat down. Who did I blame? Me. I got but the problem that I have and why people too. think I'm taking sides is because I can't sit around just listen to <laughs> You can't make threats to people. Okay. You can't say anything and then when something happens to you, cry the victim. That's a lot of these bitches do that. And I apologize for getting hype with you because I should have more respect for a queen like you, Remy. No. I appreciate you saying that, but you, it's not about me being a queen. That's this whole thing. <laughs> this is this ain't about no rap <laughs> on this queen of rap Oh, I don't give a f listen to me. I didn't have everything taken away from me. When I was sitting in that f cell, I wasn't in there praying for a mother f song. I was praying for my son. I was praying for my f husband. I was praying for my family. I was praying for my f sanity. So I don't give a f about this rap. What I want you to do, and this is me just being the realest that I can be to you. Stop playing these social media games. People get hurt I'm every day from playing on social media. Brittany, you're four. Ten, baby. What does that mean? That means that you're really Four little. Ten with the I don't That's care. what that means. I don't care. It's kind of impossible to be with the I when you're four ten. No, it's not. Can I just say something? Why do you need I a have whole no game? issues with nobody. My thing is, look, I'm tired of people always thinking that I'm the aggressor, I'm the common denominator, I'm this, I'm that. Me and my business got. Up. Me and my situation with Dream got f***ed up because of all of this. And I went home with boo pains with my new titties from Dr. Miami because of this <laughs> So that's why I said, don't flinch, don't flinch, and don't flinch, because Mariah Lynn has evolved, and she's going to stay here very pretty like this. <laughs> to the money, sis. Okay. Hey, yo, it's Safari. Listen, thanks for watching, and you are now tuned in with the brand new Love & Hip Hop YouTube, all right? Subscribe. Click it. There's a button right there. Hit it right there and subscribe, all right? Screw it!